listen to that sound of a mass conversation or of the many conversations that are going on in a public place, it's very apparent that you are able to hear a message out of noise. You disambiguate the message from the noise. That's one of the ways to get at the negentropic aspect of communication. That the code that one is able to hear out of the noise is a force of negentropy. It creates order out of the disorder. Part of the problem that people face is a naive belief that if you can't touch it, smell it, taste it, or see it, it's not real. Many people believe that unless something has a surface and has boundaries and can be brought into a laboratory and weighed on a scale, it's not real. The problem with that is that words don't have any surfaces, they don't have any veneers. When you hear a stream of sounds coming from the other's mouth. If you don't speak their language, you can't tell where one word begins and another word ends. Sound is a very different phenomena than anything seen, and yet it's the prime mode of verbal symbolism for humans. Humans live in a vast, invisible reality.